Hey everybody, welcome back and thanks for watching. In this video, we're going to talk about this 30 6 that supposedly shot Charlie Kirk. So this is going to be a quick video and I don't know why this hasn't been debunked already, but there's no possible way that the wound we saw Charlie Kirk have came from a 30 6 at 120, 200 yards away. So this is a shot that I took 250 yards with a 6.5 Creedmoor on a 25 pound block of clay. There's no way that you can take that kind of round in the neck and not have severe damage done. There's just no way. And I know some people are saying, oh, it got stuck in his bone, in his vertebrae or something like that. No, uh, that's not going to happen. Look at the energy at 250 yards from a 6.5 Creedmoor, which has less energy than a 30-06. I don't think this was a 30 out six. I don't even think this was a high velocity round at all. Here we have, this is a 5.56 five, shooting at blocks of clay. These rounds have an immense amount of energy coming through them, traveling at a very high velocity. There is no way that the wound that we are seeing is coming from a high velocity rifle round. My guess it's something that is very low velocity and it's got to be something much closer than what we're being told. Now the high definition footage that we are all waiting for that we know is right there next to Charlie in multiple positions from multiple angles that is not being given to us and it really makes you wonder why. All right, that's going to do it for this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, we'll see you later.